Hi guys, welcome to today's video, which is a demonstration using a normal deck of cards. In this video, I'm using the Magifest deck. I believe these are from 2019, I'm not too sure. And I've got a slight purple colour on the back of them. Very nice deck indeed. And they don't have your standard bicycle or tally-ho faces. And when it comes to the court cards, they have a light squared off lettering. As you can see here on the queens, the jacks, etc. And we're using two dice. And the object is, or the idea is rather, the spectator rolls the two dice until they're happy with the number shown on their roll. They can stop whenever they like. There's no force. They are to silently deal down that number of cards and cover the cards with their hand so the performer can't see how many cards they've got. And then the performer will continue on with his part. So because there's nobody here to perform with, I'm going to have to improvise the part of a spectator. So I'm going to roll the dice three times. The first two rolls are to show you they're not gaffed or gimmicked. And then we'll use the number or the total number on the third roll. So That's four and two. Four and one. So we're going to use the total rolled on this set now. Five plus four is nine. So the spectator will deal nine cards into a pile. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. The spectator will cover this packet with their hand. And then the performer will say, well, I'm not going to use the dice, but rather I'm going to roll imaginary dice in my head. And i tell you what, I've come up with the number 12 because I rolled two sixes. So the performer deals 12 cards. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The performer then asks the spectator what number they rolled, how many cards they've got, and the spectator will say 9. And just as a guard, the magician will say, yeah, I won because I got the higher number. Woohoo! Just to create a bit of humour and a laugh. But, uh, Spectator rolled 9 and you rolled 12. So what you do is you take the top card over of each pile and create two new piles. And you will keep doing this until you come to the last card on the spectator's pile, which is on this side. And match it up with the card in the same position on your pile. So these are the last two cards here, which are the two black aces. You might think that's good enough. But also, on the top card on each of these two piles, are the two red aces. That's from a normal deck of cards. There are no gaffs, no gimmicks, no duplicate cards whatsoever. And that's one of my favourite card and dice effects. Thank you for watching. See you next time.